Hi, I'm Chris Wise with Wise About Flower Mound, and I'm here with Bill Mishke, and we are at Flower Mound Taekwondo. And I just wanted to say this is just so exciting to see, like, all these belts. So my kids did karate very, very young and then decided not to do it anymore. So we got out of the dojo. But tell me, how long have you guys been here? It'll be 17 years in October. 17 years. Yes. Oh, my gosh. Right here in the same location. Oh, my gosh. Right by Al Forno's. Yes. That's great. That's great. So so what kind of ser or services, what kind of classes do you offer? We offer really cool classes for kids as young as four. Mm. Um, even some kids coming even not quite four will do okay. Okay. And we have, so we have a program for four and five year olds. Mm -hmm. Then we have a program for juniors, which are mm -hmm. elementary school age kids okay. up into middle school. And then uh, we have a teen program and we have a couple of adult programs. Okay. So is it different disciplines? How does that all work? Uh, the main thing we teach is Taekwondo, okay. and that's what we've been teaching for a long time. Uh, we've, uh, over the last seven or eight years, we've added Krav Maga training to our program, and oh. that's a separate program. Krav okay. Maga is a, a pure self-defense. It's mm. uh, excellent for adults. Adults love it. It's a great workout. Mm. It's a physical workout, and they're learning actual street-style self-defense. Okay, because, you know, Flower Mounds are really like a scary place to live. You gotta have that You know, ready bad to go, things right? actually happen well, here. Well, and I understand and that. And people <laughs> who live in Flower Mound sometimes go to places outside of Flower Mound. Yes, <laughs> definitely, definitely. <laughs> I promise you the crime is not like rampant in Flower Mound. <laughs> so, so Taekwondo, so for somebody who has no idea what that means, what does that mean? Taekwondo uh, literally is, is the uh, way of hand and foot. So mm -hmm. it's, it's um, empty handed, uh, martial art. It's a traditional martial art. We wear the uniforms and, the, and we uh, have color belts. We okay, go through so you the go belt through the colors. belt system. Okay. Yes, uh, and it's uh, a traditional martial art. You're going to learn uh, structure, discipline, focus, uh, confidence. Mm -hmm. um, it's really great for uh, getting kids a little more self-disciplined. Mm -hmm. So it might be good for what about kids that have maybe even some learning differences, or you know maybe they're hyperactive or something like that. Do they do well? in that kind of environment? Yes, actually uh, a lot of kids come here and parents bring their kids here because uh, we offer the uh, type of a program that will help them work within a structured environment. Okay. So it'll help with their focus and help with the structure. So oh, that's absolutely. good, yeah, that's yeah. great. Because I know, I mean, we've got so many kids around here. And it seems like a lot of kids are facing some, maybe some challenges with school and certainly with COVID. I mean, they had to learn via iPad, which that was not good. So I'm sure coming back and being around people again sure. might be a little bit of a challenge. Sure. And the other thing that we help with is if they, uh, we help them avoid getting into bully situations. Mm. So um, we don't. We want to keep the kids safe. Yeah. So we teach them skills that will help keep them safe. Well, and that's and that's good too because mm. the best was it the best defense is the offense. I don't even remember <laughs> something like that. Peace through strength. That's what I always say. Peace through strength. So make sure. Yes, and part of our student oath is we will build a more peaceful world. Oh, we instruct and that's great. our students to understand how to fight and how to use skills, mm -hmm. but understand the proper application and understand that we really want to achieve peace. Yeah, exactly, exactly. Well, we're on the same page there. So, so wide age range, gosh, I mean, how big are your classes or, you know, are they all It'll day depend. long or what is we, your? We have classes in the afternoons and evenings mm -hmm. and our little kids class, uh, we have that a couple times a week, and that's uh, the four and five year old class. Yeah. But then we have the, the junior class with the elementary school age kids. That class, uh, uh, we have those classes, and uh, we have quite a few kids in those classes, but mm -hmm. we have a lot of instructors. So okay. it's, it's great. The kids get to work with a variety of people. Yeah, that's good. Uh, and we have plenty of instructors to make sure they're well supervised and that they learn. Well, that is great. Well, so exciting. It's so neat to see this place and, and see what you've got. It's a lot bigger than I thought it was going to be when I walked in. Because, you know, you just think in a little center, but you're kind of, I guess, on the curve or on the yeah, end. Yeah, we're kind of so, on the end here, yeah. yeah. We've got a lot of space to so, work with. So, yeah, you've yeah. got some great space. So, so if you've been thinking about getting your Taekwondo on or your Krav Maga, is that it? That's it. Krav oh, my gosh, I got it. Um, then definitely come and check this place out. So um, I think, I mean, it's a great looking, is it still called a dojo? Well, we call it a school. We're kind of Americanized, oh, so we don't make you okay, learn. Okay, so anything. it's not all that, 
sensei stuff and no oh, i'm the instructor instruct oh i love that i love that so that's great so you don't have to think of all that stuff because yeah when we watch the karate kid nothing i mean this is totally off the subject but yeah they had some really disciplined and like some scary stuff so well we're disciplined too yes but, but not like not that scary. not like go make them do bad things so <laughs> yes right. so we're this would not guys. be the place for that you know they, they're gonna uh, uphold the law and do everything was it peace make the world more peaceful build a more peaceful world that is wonderful so that is good so everybody should have that as their mantra if you think about it if we all were to build a more peaceful world where would we be that would be pretty amazing so well bill thank you so much for your time today and i'm so glad that we had a chance to talk about your business here in flower mound mm -hmm. and hopefully Thanks for having me yeah and hopefully some people will watch this and sign up for some of the classes that he's got we've got the links in the website attached to this and we would love to have you stop by and check this place out. So thank you so much. So I'm Chris Wise with Wise About Flower Mound here with Bill Mischke, and we will see you next time. Thanks so much.